I'd be happy, man. Rangers, to me, are a sinking ship. And we'll check back in with Tom just a little bit. In the meantime, that rain is definitely... <laughs> Part of Kristen Thorne is in Smithtown in Suffolk County tonight. She can. I compare winter to be the Justin Bieber of seasons. It was kind of cute and exciting when it first started out, and now it's a bit obnoxious and should probably just stay in Canada. Over the course of the next few days, you know, right before Thanksgiving, I actually closed the complaint desk, but I'm going to have to reopen it. Hey, King, how are you? <laughs> Woo! Live TV, how are you, buddy? It's not your turn yet. You have to wait one more segment, okay? Just let me do the weather. I know you're stoked. So are we. All right, let's just go to the map so we can get him off of here in a graceful fashion. Push into our virginity, push into our vicinity. I was about to say Virginia and vicinity at the same time. And I said, what are you doing running? And you're saying it was really good out? It's the perfect texture for running. Very low impact on its dry snow so your feet don't get wet. We've seen a lot of people out here, like he said, running, sledding, just enjoying it. One thing, oops. That can happen. Once it's turned on, the sign will spell out Delhi Cat Essen. Take us out. You see that? Did you see okay. it? There it is again. Seriously. There, there it is again. I, I, Man, we're all jumping around. Okay. Woo. This is cool. We're Man, really I'll tell you what. If, if, if you need to wake up this morning. <laughs> oh, okay. I have Look. a bad point. Oh, okay. there, hey, there, uh, there goes Wayne. <laughs> Wayne's right by you. <laughs> Woo. Man, we're all up. <laughs> I cannot handle this. <laughs> Man, I tell you what, I, I could run a marathon right now. I am so I, awake. And when I t no more coffee is Shaking. needed for today. We are good. My goodness. I'm Teresa Smith, Bob Williams, <laughs> Julia Johnson. Good morning, what Tennessee. To say. Yeah. All right. Uh, well, Wayne's on top of it. It's so that's still oh, there he is again. Man, I don't know why I'm ducking. I, I mean, it's like it's. I promise you, I'm behind us again. Yeah, he's behind us again. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I think they're opening some doors Good in the back there. Let's Listen. bring in Weather Channel meteorologist Mike Seidel. He's in Sugar Mountain, North Carolina. Hi, Mike. Why? Well, obviously, Mike, not quite ready for us, but let's turn to some other news we're following on this uh, Saturday night. I, I is how do democracies respond to those scandals. Uh, and what will it mean for, uh, for the wider region? I think one of your children has just walked in. I mean, shift, shifting, shifting sands in the region, do you think relations with the North may change? Um, I would be surprised if they do. <laughs> the, um, pardon me. Sorry, pardon me. Um, My apologies. <laughs> what will this going to be for the region? My apologies. North, uh, sorry. Um, North Korea, North, uh, South Korea's policy choices on North Korea have been severely limited. Check, yeah. check out this view, and I'm sorry, I'm suffering from hiccups all of a sudden. Uh -oh. This should be interesting, right? <laughs> see, there it goes again. Before we start to see that mix out, we'll see a couple of showers. We're starting to see some improvements, and then that should quickly mix out for the high, highlands. <laughs> Excuse me, I'll see the cloud. Clouds in place, showers this morning, <laughs> Shower, showers, the isol isolated showers, that chance of showers. And then into the weekend. Esse equipamento causou um curto-circuito e um transformador. E o próprio sistema desligou esses circuitos para que a falha não, não se estendesse ainda mais. Ainda há risco de ter mais algum apagão aqui em Pouso Alegre, na nossa região? Não, o nosso produto ele é exposto. Hey, Os que se mirem, se revnoem de sua lovca, se, por exemplo, perepreguivam esse lojo. Ну не всех это получается. Dry desert, uh, not a lot of moisture in the desert, uh, in the Mojave Desert. Uh, the green here means it's very lush. It's a, it's a tropical area, kind of a rainforest. If you've never been to the Arizona rainforest, Keep go going, check it out. I'm it's almost an amazing, there. amazing time. Uh, also today, 24-hour um, rain totals that you can see up in here. Uh, there's one, two, two, three, four, five, six inches. Don't do, oh gosh. Oh. Go, 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 go. Jeez. Come over here. Since the snow started this morning at about 6.15 to 6.30. It has not let up at all. It is coming down pretty steadily here in Springfield. You can see that the uh, visibility has been reduced. I've seen countless spin outs and um, 
And uh, three after seven. Here's oh, sorry. Okay, that was scary. That was right. <laughs> we had a light pop. And that was no, not that pretending was not. or being dramatic. <laughs> oh, no, boy, that was, at, least, <laughs> at least you handled it well. Yeah. Wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we had a light pop. <laughs> you I wasn't him? even ready for the that. The thing is, it's that like was... it popped, he yelled, and then grabbed his heart. <laughs> Hello and welcome. Cheese? No, no, Hi. Okay. Hang on a second, guys. Are we talking about doing the story? I'm going to go when somebody tells me, am I doing a tease or are we doing the story itself? And first and last name, please. Uh, Erica O'Donnell. And can you spell first and last? F I R S T L A S T. I met your first and last name. Uh, <laughs> A police department in California is taking an unusual approach to catch porn pirates red handed. Porch pirates, yes. Oh, <laughs> off, pardon me. <laughs> Over the last two years, hundreds have landed in the Summit County Medical Examiner's Office. My brother used to break in our house and steal the TV. But now he's dead. I'm on Jackson Street and I, I call the police on my own kids. I'm sick of it. Hey, boy, shut up. Here's a at four. Welcome to NBC Boston News at four o'clock. Is Dunkirk good, Simon? Stuck. Some stuff. Oh, 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 whoa, whoa. Oh. <laughs> yeah, live television, baby. Yeah. That's how we do it. Oh, oh again. Oh. Ooh. Okay. If you think you see the man in this sketch, they want you to call the police tips hotline at number 816-474-TIPS. And we're live in Waldo tonight. Larry Seward, NBC Action News. Wait, oh, no, no. I'm so sorry. No, I'm sorry. He was wearing a white t-shirt and blue jeans whenever he took off. Investigators say Two Hispanic men pistol whipped a 71 year old man, but say the victim was not the target. It's the wrong video right there. Officer Sub News reporter Christine Pay is at the scene with what we know. Apparently, we don't have that story. Right now, astronomers at the university. Shooting investigation in Southwest Albuquerque. You can see right here. I, I tell you what, you working for Marvel, the Super Bowl commercial. Did you get a lot of reaction to that Super Bowl commercial? What Super Bowl commercial? You know what? I've been my mistake. I, you know see, what? What? see, you're you're as crazy as the people on Twitter. Right. I'm not Lawrence Fishburne. <laughs> That's my fault. Oh, I know boy. that. Oh. That was my fault. Uh, my mistake. You know what? Oh. We don't all look alike. Oh. Oh. You're oh. Exactly right. all black and famous. You but are we all guilty. Don't look alike. The panel said it welcomed the apology, but said some of the financial costs could have been avoided. Caroline, thank you. He says what you're doing is you're doing down the departmental spending because you need to find deeper cuts in spending in government departments. So in real terms, that means spending on things like schools, on hospitals. I might give up on that. Um, Our royal correspondent, Nicholas Witchell, has the details at Balmoral for us now. Nicholas, what does it say? I didn't make anybody stay here until 7 a.m. or 11 or whenever it is everybody finally left. I didn't make this kid pass out on my floor. People wanted to be here. Very, very strong. West Press in the mix, North Kapark in the mix. And I think everyone's enjoying just how, how even and how good a league it is this year. So I'm going to hand the microphone over to my buddy Danny here and go Wildcats. All right, hey, Paul, get you inside. Enjoy that game. We'll see you back here at 10 o'clock. Thanks so much.